Hello and welcome to Remnant 2, the sequel to Remnant from the Ashes, one of my favorite games the year that it came out. Um, an incredible mashup of Dark Souls with guns, but a cooperative multiplayer focused version of that. Uh, really, really, really big swings in terms of its art direction and world design and character design. Just everything about that game really worked for me. Uh, I loved it. I was a really big fan. And honestly, Remnant 2 has become one of my most anticipated games of the year, so much so that I pre-ordered the game so I could play it early. And here I am playing it early. Uh, I'm, I'm really stoked about it. I have just made a character. I'm going to choose Survivor as a difficulty. Uh, I'm probably gonna try at least starting out. I'm gonna I'm gonna do the uh, class that they made specifically for people playing solo, and we'll see how that goes. This game was originally supposed to be DLC for the first game, and then uh, I think just the success of the first game kind of maybe took them by surprise. I don't really know, or maybe their ideas for that DLC just kind of grew and grew and grew. But here we are with a full sequel. Oh, that is quite a drop. Let me help you down. That's me. That's the character I made. I got this, this guy. You okay? Oh. Dead already. Wow. That's three. What? Oh, please. Three times I saved your life. The sinkhole, your foot. What? You'd be dead if my mom hadn't taught me to dress a wound. Fine. Two times then. The sinkhole and just now. Hey, let me see that. Leave it. It's nothing. Hey, oh. I'm fine. Come on, roll up your sleeve and just admit we're friends already. This is not an admission. Let me see. That looks like uh. It's getting worse. Zombie stuff. Listen, it ain't broken or bleeding. It'll calm down. It always does. It always does. What Let's does that go. mean? Kit said the ward was this way. The session will be joinable after completing the tutorial. That's good to know. Um, one of the things that I really loved about the first game, I think just visually, is uh, in the beginning it looks very much like it's just The Last of Us. Like playing Dark Souls with guns in huh. The Last of Us. That old fairy tale? Yeah. Like this ward. Old white guy founds it. Food and fresh water, everyone gets along. <laughs> that sounds like the fairy tale to me. It's probably just a couple of old timers holed up underground. I just hope they got a few supplies for trade. Otherwise, we won't last much longer out here. Anyway, point being, uh, it very quickly becomes not that. You think people actually live like this? Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure. I don't know what's in that Fulton's original blend, but I've never seen nobody that happy before. Not in real life. <laughs> yeah. Wow, for the finer things in life. Oh, now we're back. All right. Full speed. Yeah, this game like looks and immediately fe even just like moving around the world looks and feels a lot better. I have to assume uh, that's not gonna work. And I have to climb up this. Great. Uh, we can't turn back now. Ain't got nowhere to go. There's gotta be another way through. Dude, found it. Um, I have to imagine what they're trying to do is the same magic trick twice. Because honestly, like the first game was well received but i don't think it did great like i don't i don't maybe i'm maybe i'm wrong about that but i i just don't feel like that game really like blew up i think the people who played it were like ravenous about it kind of like cult classic status hey unlock the damn door it's about time what took you 
But it seems like they're really focusing on bringing a lot more people with this game. Uh, and I think a good way to do that is to do the same magic trick twice. Bloodroot. I don't know what any of the items do in this game. Uh, can I open these lockers? No. Oh, yeah, the... the... Oh. Gun time. Can I open this door? Can't let it go to waste. Use it on that bum ankle of yours. Won't help me none. Oh. Press L1 and then square to use the item in quick stock one. Let's get some distance between us and those bugs. Okay. Nice. Oh, it's gonna heal me for 30 seconds. Hey, over here. Doing a little uh co-op. Cooperative door opening. Bingo. Gotta look around. Gotta gotta investigate. Looks like they're giving me infinite stamina at the moment, which is very nice of them. I can just sprint through the tutorial. Dodging and sprinting depletes your stamina. While I'm while in combat. Oh wow. It was almost like they heard me saying that. And then wanted to dunk on me. Um Alright. Are we about to be in combat? Oh, this is bad. This is bad with a side of broccoli. A side of what? Nothing. Something my ma used to say. All right, what do we got? What do we got? Where are we dropping, boys? There we go. Shoot the damn nice shooting. Hey, that don't count, by the way. Well, at least that's over. One and done. I, I was honestly expecting that to take a couple more shots. Okay. Wow. I've been looking forward to this game for so long. I'm so, I'm so excited right now. I can't believe how many good games just came out over the past couple days. This and Pikmin 4 out on the same day, by the way. Wild. Viewfinder early in the week. Down we go. Into the upside down. Wow, we are really in the sewers. Oh, that sounds bad. You're not going to, like, ask how she's doing or anything. Very rude, honestly. Uh, This feels like a place I'm going to get to shoot some things in. Wow. a nest like this out here no nope. maybe best we head back we retrace our steps we can find another way out yeah or here they come oh my god oh Oh, God. Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. No! <gasps> Dude. Hey, 
Listen. For what it's worth. You were a good friend. <laughs> you were a good friend. Wow. They're going to kill me off right at the right at the top. Make a character and then just wipe him out. I kind of love that if that's if that's the move they've decided to commit to. Yeah. I mean, sure did get stabbed all the way through, though. These tree monsters are fun. I took a couple hits in that in that combat. I gotta get better at dodging. Whoa, whoa, hold up. We're friends. We're here to help. Can't hold this forever, Bo. Whoa. Superpowers. Okay. Nice. Thanks. Who, who are you? Questions later. We gotta get moving. On three. Wow. It is very Stranger Things, huh? That's all I got. You're on your own now. Hey, we still got each other. <laughs> right. Follow us, you two. That won't be the last of them. But are we the last of us? Asking the big questions. Every Wednesday on HBO. Sorry, on Max. All right, this way. Root or thick down here. Must be what I felt back at the ward. Wait, <coughs> you're from the ward? Shit. <coughs> Maybe Santa's real too. Yeah, it's not far from here, but the way down collapsed behind us. We're gonna have to find another way out. Dude, I hope Santa is in this game. How good <laughs> would, that, would that be? <laughs> uh, all right. Wow. Wow, cool to have a bunch of people. This gun they gave me is very good. Oh, it is not over. My guy. Bad situational awareness. That's how he got stabbed in the back. Here we go. So as I mentioned, I think at the top, uh, a big part of this game is a multiplayer focus. I think you can have up to three people. It might only be two, but it might also be three. Oh, damn. That's over. And I think introducing you to the multiplayer experience via this tutorial that you play by yourself. Very smart. Um, that's not to say you can't play this game alone. And like I said, I'm, I'm going to pick the class that is specifically built for playing this game solo, which I'm really excited about. There they come. Um, but I am definitely also going to start a second character and play multiplayer. Uh, if you haven't seen the series of streams that Steven and I did, uh, press R2 to do a melee attack. Oh, yeah, when you're not aiming, you can melee. Um, if you haven't seen the series of streams that Steven and I did as CJ and the Hammer, uh, I'll, I'll link them. But uh, that was really early on, I think, and in into the Aether, so I imagine a lot of people haven't seen that stuff. But, man, what a blast we had. I think that was the reason the two of us 
love that game so much was just like it's so fun to play with a friend. It's very pretty. Something's here. The dead would know they've lost. But they won't lay down without a fight. Yeah, dude. Oh, I uh, was not paying attention. <laughs> I had my controller on the desk. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. The root mantis. Oh, damn. Oh. Okay. As long as he's not attacking me, I'm happy. Oh! <laughs> oh, God. You can see where the Dark Souls elements come in here. Oh. No, 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 no. I hate that. I hate that. Ooh! Oh my god. Yeah. Ooh, I got ganglia. Well, at least that's over. Hey, you okay? Not bad shooting, traveler. Yeah, I had some practice. I'll bet. But don't worry. Ward's as safe a place as any. Safer. Safer, even. It's really real. Food water and folks living with some old white guy <laughs> more or less <laughs> whoa whoa let me get you some more i'm fine i don't yes. Ooh, that looks like root rot i've never seen a case this bad. oh god i'm fine i don't know why everyone seems bad <laughs> Doctor, there's our only chance. We'd better get moving. Before we lose the light. Bingo. Iron. The ward. I guess it's just an outpost for humanity. I like my guy I made. Nice. Don't worry. Briggs is right. She'll be fine. Are you okay? Just a headache. Hey, hey, Clementine. Uh, let me get you some water. I'm fine. Oh, you're not fine. You need rest. Oh. 
There's a lot more uh, story and narrative. Thinks that puts him in charge of characters. And everyone. Listen, I'm gonna check in with Ford, and then I'll get some rest. Okay? I've been through a lot worse, you know. So, uh, traveler, um, <clears throat> your friend will be fine. I'm Bo, Bo Ward, and this is Ward 13. Oh. He must have come a long way. Bo Ward of Bo Ward 13. Ward all, but the road's still a dangerous place. What were you two doing out there? We were looking for Ward. For the Ward? Really? Huh. I didn't know anybody knew what we were doing here. <laughs> we've just, uh, you know, we've been cut off from the world for so long that... Well, I'm surprised people know about us outside the gate. Feels kind of nice, actually. Hey, ask around if you need something. Oh, start with Ford. Ford? Sure he'd like Ward? You. you think the root are really gone for good? I don't know. But I don't think it matters. Hmm. Press that to view the map. Oh, yeah, I got trait points. One of the things I loved about the first game, you shift around. One of the things I loved about the first game was uh, their inventory system and the uh, upgrade system was, like, really, really streamlined. Whereas in the Souls games, you obviously have your, like, Excel spreadsheet, very, like, D&D &D adjacent. Uh, much more chill in Remnant which I think makes it a really good entry point into that style of game for a lot of people. Um, so right now we can increase any of these traits. Spirit increases mod power generation. I don't know what that is yet. Reduces skill cooldowns. I don't have any of those yet. Uh, I guess I'll start with health. That seems like a good one. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna commit changes. And uh, over time we'll get some more stuff. Anyway, Oh, wait, yeah, what is, what is that thing I picked up? Okay. Um, unexplored. Is there, like, a pri... Yeah, okay, primary objective. You should be in the main warehouse. It's, uh, oh, there we go. This is not up for discussion, Clementine. You're staying, and that's final. I don't remember asking for your permission. Uh... <clears throat> we'll talk about this later. Out of my way. Okay. Hi, Clementine. Whoa. What have we here? Ah, the... The Traveler. traveler of course. Wallace said... Yes. Uh, right on time. Sorry you had to see that. But then again, you've been around. I'm sure you know. Families fight. Andrew Ford. Good to... Make your acquaintance. Founder Ford. In the flesh. They say you're on. <laughs> they say you're hundreds of years old. You've got a lot of questions, and I've got a favor to Not ask. answering the question, Let's Ford. To it. You first. Uh. If you're really the Ford that built this place, That's how are you alive? A longer story than I can indulge right now. Let's keep it to this. You know how some things you drink can make you drunk. And some things you eat can make you sick or sleepy. Well, other things do this. It's a big world out there. Yeah, I, I want I want some of that. Hook me up. Not my way. And you want to be careful what you wish for, traveler. Um, let's see. What kind? What kind of? Actually, no. Where are you expecting me? Uh, not you precisely, as in. Name, rank, serial number. But I knew someone was coming. Our young Wallace told me. Wallace? He's a special kid. A lot like somebody I used to know. She had bad dreams, too. Dreams about things that hadn't yet come to pass. Mm. I wonder if this is all related to the first game and stuff I forget because it's, it's been so long. Like he can see really far into the present. <laughs> sometimes. Okay. All right, traveler. Now that you've shot your shot, here's mine. I need 
an able young scrapper to help an old man out. Talk to Wally. You'll find him out by the docks. After that, gear up, and then meet me at the ward gate. I'll tell you a story. All right. Nice. Uh, is this a chest I can open? Sure looks like it, but uh, no, no button prompt. Maybe some other time. Let's keep looking around, I guess. Yeah, I'm going to leave her alone. She seems upset. I'm kind of amazed at how much dialogue is in this game. Maybe I'm wrong and misremembering, but I don't remember there being that much in the first. I know there were some, but it was like all very cryptic, cryptic and, you know, classic, like, people don't really want to talk to you energy. Oh, friend. <laughs> Glad to see you all right. What can I do for you? Oh, yeah. That's right. But everybody calls me Riggs. I try to keep oh. safe out there. My specialty is armor and weapons upgrades. Speaking of which, Bo mentioned you might need some help getting your feet back on, do you? Well, whatever you need, don't be afraid to ask. We all help each other out here. <laughs> Even McCabe. Be safe out there. Uh, let's take a look at this. Talk to Wallace before our trip to the old ward. They're not telling me who Wallace is. Or where Wallace is. Is Wallace one of the people that I met earlier? Ah, looking for Wallace? He's got a place overlooking the docks. Overlooking the docks? That seems like it's over here. There we go. Hello. Looking for Wallace. Uh, he's up there. Best view in town. Miss Clementine says we gotta look out. <gasps> wow. I can't believe how much like bigger this game feels. This is very cool. I see you, traveler. You're the one Ford's been waiting for. Though he doesn't know he's been waiting. He thinks he needs help. It's her who needs it. Ooh. You know, and you don't. Sorry, I shouldn't say. Things get messier when I tell them. I'm Wallace. Did I say that yet? Probably. You have a path to walk. You choose the first step here, but your path can change if you want it to. Mm. Ah, here we go. All right, wait, let's go back real quick. Medic. The medic specializes in survivability with enhanced healing and relic effectiveness. Redemption. Shockwave healing shield. Wellspring. Uh, this might be good for a multiplayer character. We'll consider that. Hunter, long range. Marking enemies. Okay. Challenger. Love this. Oh my god. Close range combat and height and survivability. The handler. There we go. This is uh what is supposed to be the solo class. Oh my god. This game rocks. Uh we're gonna go with handler because then we get a dog. And um I don't know. We'll see how it, we'll see how it goes. Yep. That makes a lot of sense now. You're right, of course. Your path is waiting. Tell Brabus and McCabe I sent you. They have what you need. They're the next step on your journey. Until next time. Cool. So now I have a dog. That rocks. Uh and I think Hey, look at all this stuff I got. They just like gave me a bunch of armor. It's pretty cool. Traits. Kinship. Reduces friendly fire damage dealt and received by 8%. 8 oh, that is interesting. Oh, it also changed my stats a bunch. That's cool. Um, and I have a bunch of skills. Which I imagine it'll explain eventually. My dog just seems to be named Dog. According to that little thing on the top left which is funny 
All right, let's uh, see. Mm, you'll probably want to talk to Gravis. He'll set you up if you, if you plan on heading back out there. Gravis. So many new faces these days. Things must be getting a mite easier out there. Welcome, traveler. I'm Reginald Malone. But my friends call me Reggie. But you can too. So you come in with Bowen and tied <laughs> there. Or you can be sure they'll do everything they can for your friend. Ain't the first to come through here needing help. Oh. Have you been here a long time? Uh, longer than I care to think about. At my age, uh, time. Well, it uh, compresses in a way. Oh, it's not a bad thing, just different. Uh, keeping our stories alive is how I make sense of things. And I'm always looking for new tales. I'd love to hear yours, Traveler. Wow, that's great. Uh, fair enough, friend. If you ever need a fit, <laughs> don't right. be a stranger. Uh, Brabus. Okay? Watch yourself. She's a prickly one. She's over at the warehouse. McCabe. Oh, that's what I was trying to talk to you before. Hello. I swear to God and my mother. Did Bo send you over here, or did you stumble your way over here yourself? Shit. You're serious, aren't you? All right. So, what the hell is this journey? <laughs> sounds crazy to me. I just got here. <laughs> Damn right it sounds crazy. But that's how I know you ain't lying. Only Wally would do that to a person. Fine. Well, the only reason anyone bothers me is because I'm good with a hammer. So either I can modify your weapons, or we can find a more creative use for it. <laughs> Tell you what. I heard you picked up something strange on your little jaunt earlier. True. Maybe I could do something with it. Okay. NPCs throughout the world and Ward 13 can be used to craft new items. Weapon mods, boss weapons, armor, etc. Each crafting recipe has a number of required materials. Yes. Craft. Healing shot. Concussive shot. Wait. Launches a payload that explodes on contact with allies. Healing. Okay. When no ally is struck, payload lays dormant until an ally gets close. I wonder if I could use that on myself. Fires a focus blast of air through all targets. That seems pretty cool. Scrap shot. A grenade. I mean, it seems helpful to have a grenade. Ooh, or I can burn things, which honestly seems very good for uh, these root enemies, which I'll probably be fighting for a little while. That ought to help with whatever journey he saw you on. Just tell Wally to be more specific next time. Yeah. So we're done here, right? Or do I need the hammer again? No, we're good. <sighs> Look, it's not personal. I just don't like it pisses me off when people so I'll make you a deal. Oh. You find, find anything, anything useful. Out there. Bring it back to me. Bring it back to me and I'll see if I can use it to mod your weapons. Thanks. Oh, and if you tell anyone I was nice to you, I will cut you. All right. Rabbis. Well, ain't you a right mother? Rick's in in here like you own the place. That boy what talks to the root? <laughs> I don't trust Wally with a hot meal. <laughs> but I also ain't dumb enough to cross him. I don't reckon he was any more specific. He said you'd know what I needed. Right. Well, the boy's crazy, but he ain't stupid. I can see your gear is, uh, lacking, to say the least. If he asks, you tell him I gave you this. Uh, no charge. Ah. <laughs> Riggs is gonna talk my ear off if I don't send you over to him next, isn't well. he? Fine. Go see Riggs then. Tell him he can do whatever the hell he wants. Sure. Let me uh take a look at all that stuff I just got. That's a pretty huge upgrade. Huh. Got a claw. Rab has got to polish his stuff more. King Sheet's straight in this. Hmm. Cool. Inspect weapon to equip a mod. 
That's pretty sick. Can I... Oop. This thing can also have mods. Can I put the same mod on two things? No. Okay, so we're going to put it on this. Let's talk to Riggs, and maybe we'll be on our way. How goes it, friend? Brabus. I don't suppose he was more particular about what ride. Well, I've got a pretty focused company. Okay. If you, you ever need to upgrade your equipment. Some characters can upgrade your items. Great. Uh Let's upgrade this melee thing. Alright. Now back to Ford, who I think is at the gate, correct? That's by the entrance to the old ward, yeah. Okay, so that's back where I started. Or is it not? Uh you remind me of Brad too. Yeah. I know. Where could the old entrance be? Is it back this way? Oh yeah, down here. Got a cool dog. Got a got a hat. Got a backpack. Geared up and ready. Should we head out? Or uh, is there something you wanted to do first? No, let's do it. Glad to hear it. Follow me. Little bit of a slow start. I'll be honest. I'm excited to see more of what this game has has to offer. I trust this team pretty implicitly after what they managed to pull off with the first game. Still smells like home. Here, take this. Just crank the handle to make it work. Oh, little saxophone? This used to be a research facility, cutting edge. We did things down here nobody dreamed of. Not before nor since. Hang on a second. For all our manpower, we didn't know what the stones really were. Until it was too late. Oh, okay. Stones? <laughs> the world stones. Giant red crystals that let us see into other worlds. Oh, yeah. Even travel to them. So, what? We just hide the stones away and hope the Soviets hadn't found their own? <laughs> no. We had to know everything there was to know. It was a matter of national security, of pride. Wow, Oppenheimer in theaters now. We opened the door and walked through. Something was waiting on the other side. It didn't happen right away. Hell, <laughs> the inhabitants of the worlds we traveled to we thought we were safe. But yeah, the root found a way. After that, well, we all know what happened after that. Uh, open the door. Locked, huh? Well, this is my house. <laughs> Come on. I gave Ellen a few things to hang on to in case of emergency. Uh, she must have hidden it around here some come on Ellie where'd you hide it uh let's take a look mm, locker oh seems like over here bingo a matchbook we call it a dragon hawk <laughs> Don't ask why. Don't ask Keep why. You. you might need it. It's my Estus flask. All right. Hey, take a look at that matchbook you found. I got a hunch. 
Oh, this is kind of cool. Let's get this door unlocked. Can't stand around all day. Huh. I wonder how much of that I'll be doing. Investigating items and picking up like that. Is that the... The world stone. Yes. Or part of it anyway. Every shard's as useful as the whole. We shut it down after Harsgard died. Like I told Ellen at the time. The damn thing's more dangerous than useful. Huh. Of course not. Uh, never mind. Now, let's see if that worked. Work to do what exactly? Holy shit. Here we are. to bury this place not just lock it away but get some explosives and bury it in a tomb of concrete no i want to travel more dangerous than useful traveler remember that oh Ford? see ya <laughs> Ford. oh man bo is gonna be pissed not unless i jump in there also Utilities required. Oh. my dog traveling to another world oh okay blood root the session is now joinable oh, I'm getting all my like pre-order bonuses is that what's happening we'll uh, stick with the stock stuff for now oh yeah we are in it Bye, dog. Both the crystal. See you later. <laughs> I better get moving off of Whoa. Off Hell yeah. Now this is remnant. Whoa. Hello. Uh, okay. This looks important. All right. Oh. Radicals turning red. Oh, wow. Hell yeah. 
Oh man, I'm so stoked right now. <laughs> oh, this is good. Okay, I have to press circle and dismiss that. Hello. Am I shooting you? Are we friends? Where did you come from? How did you find your route? You should not even exist. Okay. Well, see ya. <laughs> Goodbye. Nice chatting. Oh, this rocks. Oh. Your presence creates new interesting possibilities. I have many questions. Find my tower within the wastes beyond. Look for a glowing white orb. Oh. Look for a glowing white orb. Oh, right. Press R1 to activate the weapon mod. Okay. Uh, tower in the wastes. Oh my god, this is so cool looking. This is the remnant experience. It's just like, oh! Jumping off a cliff! <laughs> Alright. Well, first death. <laughs> okay. Good to get it out of the way, you know? I'm gonna have to take these very slow elevator rides again. Oh, there goes my dog. The dog situation's very funny. Oh! So maybe I didn't need the uh, fire mod. Oh, God. Oh, boy, that's over. Considering I'm fighting robots, maybe maybe not the best choice. How did you find Nerud? Okay. Gotta bring that elevator back up. Cool that you knew how to do that, man. Ta-da. Pink. Find the glowing white orb. There we go. <laughs> this is going to be uh, great. How long until the dog despawns? All right, still hanging out. All right. Anyway, um, combat. Press L1 plus R1 to use your primary skill. I will do that later. That's it. For now. First, I have to not jump off a cliff. Get whatever this is. Iron. There we go. Oh, you can pet the dog. That's nice. Alright, yeah. L1 plus R1 to use the primary skill. I will do that next time there's an enemy. See what happens. Press R2 to do melee attack. Hold R2 to perform a charged melee attack. Yes, 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 I understand. I <laughs> can't believe I jumped off that that platform. Rest that checkpoint. You bet I will. Bingo. Resting. Resting at checkpoints replenishes ammo and relics at the cost of respawning all basic enemies in the world. And multiplayer resting also respawns any fallen allies. All players must be using a checkpoint in order to rest. 
Great. I'm going to stick with uh, being on this world for now. I feel like the dog's not going to be very good at attacking the flying enemies. Maybe I'm wrong about that. The dog seems to be uh, breaking a lot of a lot of rules. I thought it might be useless to try and use the dog. Hello. Uh, okay, I guess next enemy. More iron? I'll say yes. Oh, oh, poison, poison, poison. No, thank you. Huh. Okay. Well, don't go that way. Um, so the way the, the first game worked, which was really interesting, was that the world, if you were playing story mode, would, uh, kind of a little bit randomly generate itself it was a little bit randomly generated but not completely um and if you beat the game and went to go play again then it would randomly generate itself so every time you played you'd experience something new Alright, I'm, I'm using I'm using my skills. Woo. Woo. Oh my god. Oh, hello. Woo. Oh my god. That's rough. Huh. This isn't looking good. I don't quite understand how R1 activates my weapon mod and also activates my skill. I feel like I should uh Let's see what's down here. All right. Oh. Full dicey already. Holy hell. Little dicey. All right, let's pick up this iron. Just one, just one iron. Come on. Throw me a bone. Or some iron. Hello. Here we go. Glad that's over. I guess I should heal, but I feel like I'm gonna show up at a rest point soon. Unless this is a boss. <laughs> Which would be really bad for me. <laughs> Bandage. I don't know where they found these bandages. Alright. Oh, I just crouched by accident. How did I do that? Oh. Oh, I just healed by accident. I didn't mean to do that. Terminus station. Grab some iron. Wow. How cool. 
What is this? Oh, something that's broken. Oh, nice. Area map. Not sure where to go. Look for the estimation point. Either the travel map or the area map. Okay. I'll pull up the area map. See what it looks like. Uh... No exclamation point on the map at all. Okay, this is it. That's it. Hmm. I'm worried about the ammo situation. I know it's not bad yet, but it might get bad later. There we go. Okay. All those guys out. I'm really so nervous about falling off of this platform again. Is that a guy? Yeah. Some ammo. sick. I wonder what the exper- oh, shouldn't have paused. That was, that was bad timing. Um, are there guys coming from behind me? Really sounded like they were coming from everywhere. Oh. Man, having a dog? Really helpful. Oh, God. Let's light this thing on fire. Uh, the dog being able to pull aggro is uh, really smart. I think my first episode of Wavelengths was about this dog. If I recall correctly. Oh. That hurt. And it hurts a second time. I wonder if there's a way to get that off. Like if I if I do a little dodge. Like if I roll on the ground, if I can roll whatever that second thing is off of me. God, this is so cool looking. Honestly, that opening definitely takes a little bit too long, and I was kind of rushing through it just for the sake of this video, also. Uh but now that we're in it, I am, like, really in it. Like, I'm so stoked to be back in Remnant right now. Bingo. Smash some stuff. Hmm. Nothing. This reminds me a little bit of the area before you hit uh, Majula. Is it Majula? In, in Dark Souls 2. With the, uh, with the coffin. And the birds who want Silky. If you played that game, you probably know what I'm talking about. Oh, going up. Oh, not even that high. All right. Oh, no, thank you. No, thank you. All right, we're going to activate. That was not good. Oh, God. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. What's happening, what's happening? Oh my god, I'm taking so many hits. Get 
Ah. Oh my god. No! <laughs> oh. Can my dog heal me? Oh, <gasps> no way! Okay, you've gotta go. Oh, God. Oh. That was brutal. Wow. Uh, if I die, though, that's that's going to be it for me. So did I, did I get a new trait? Is that what happened? Yeah, one, one trait point available. Uh, kinship. Reduces friendly fire damage. That's still pretty cool. Expertise. What does this do? Skill cooldown. Stamina. I feel like health is still the way, right? Oh, zero available. Oh, okay. Whoops. Maybe I should be changing my armor. No, I'll, I'll stick with the opening stuff. Uh, new perk. Yeah, wait, hang on. Let's see what's up with that. Character. Open archetype menu. Oh, perks. Here we go. Okay. Gain 3% rage and, sk and skill damage while companion is active and within 25 meters of the player. Oh, that's cool. Hmm. Some iron. Hate that. Hate that. Okay. I am so scared of everything now. Something over here. Yep. Oh, God. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, that sound. Oh, my God. Oh, Jesus. I'm I'm done for. Anyway, there's a sound that plays when a when a big enemy shows up. And uh sure did play right there. I am dead. Man. Uh Remnant 2. I'm right back in it. I'm excited to play more, but I'm going to cut this one off. Uh stay tuned. I imagine there will be more multiplayer Remnant 2 showing up on this YouTube channel and on our Twitch channel at twitchtv cast. Uh, but for now, I'm very tired, and I'm going to go to sleep. And by that, I mean I'm going to lie in bed and probably play Pikmin. So have a good one. Thank you for watching, and bye-bye.